everyone, it is Deanna. Welcome to another video on my channel. And today I'm really excited because I recently got this sharpener from Classroom Friendly Supplies. And inside of this box is a pencil sharpener. Classroom Friendly Supplies is a pencil supply company. The owner of it is actually a teacher. In the box, it's gonna come in this little plastic case. This pencil sharpener can be used with a mount or without. For today, I'm not going to mount it. So I pulled up the directions online from the classroomfriendlysupplies.com website and I'm gonna see how well <laughs> I can follow directions and if we can make this thing work. I also have several different kinds of pencils. I have your top of the line Ticonderoga. We all know as teachers that is the best pencil ever. And if that's top of the line, then bottom of the line <laughs> must be these uh, Jot pencils from the Dollar Tree. And then I guess middle of the line would be these uh, Target pencils. So I'm gonna try all three kinds of pencils out. What I need to do is go to my supply closet uh, in my classroom and grab some pencils that are not already sharpened because, I mean, how else are we gonna review the pencil sharpener? Step one, pull the silver face forward until it locks in place. So pinch the two black knobs, insert the pencil completely into the sharpener, put one hand on top of the sharpener to hold it secure. And the face will pull the pencil in automatically and pinch the two black knobs to release the pencil. Oh my gosh, this is the sharpest pencil I have ever seen. Guys, that was pretty amazing. This just slides out really easily. You can dump it out when you're ready and put it back in. So this is really easy to use. I don't think that I'm going to use the mount because I like the fact that I can just move this around really easily. Today is Friday. I can't wait till Monday to show this to my students. And I don't know, this is a treasure. I don't know <laughs> if I want my kids using this or not. Because um, for many years, the rule was that my students don't touch the pencil sharpener because um, every time they do, they break it. And my pencil sharpener I bought before was like $60. And this one is only, okay, so I'm looking at the website now. Sorry if it's a little shaky. And this is the one that I have right here in the cool blue. It is $24.99 for one sharpener, but if you buy three, you'll save 30% and it will only be $53.97. And that's a great deal because the sharpener that I've been buying um, ever since I've been a teacher really, that electronic blue pencil sharpener, it's $60 for one, but for less than $60, you get three sharpeners and these things are amazing. And if you need to replace the blades, you can do that without purchasing a whole new pencil sharpener. Well, I am hooked on this. Like I have literally never in 12 years of teaching seen a pencil this pointy and sharp. Like it just, this is unheard of. So now let's try out our bottom of the line. <laughs> and I'm totally making that up. Let's try out the bottom of the line jot pencil sharpener from the Dollar Tree. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this Dollar Tree bottom of the line pencil. Absolutely amazing. How does it write? This is Amazing. Sometimes pencils do this thing where no matter how much you sharpen it, it just still will not sharpen. So let's try this one out and see what happens. Wow. So this pencil that was not sharpening before has been salvaged. That is amazing. Here's the thing, I have like a thousand pencils on my desk right now, but I can tell which ones I just sharpened because no other pencil sharpener is going to make it as sharp as this. This pencil sharpener is what I am going to call the great equalizer because it lets all the pencils be great. So I have my Ticonderoga pencil that is just as sharp as my Dollar Tree pencil that is just as sharp as my middle of the line 
Dixon pencil that is just as sharp as my pencil that the top was like weird and it just wouldn't sharpen no matter how much I tried with the other one. Like this thing is just, it's the great equalizer. So if you're looking for a pencil sharpener, if you're a new teacher especially, don't waste your, well let me not say waste. Um, I think the best use of your money would be to get three of these sharpeners or even like if that's not in the budget, just start out with one. You will not be disappointed. You'll be very pleased with it. So there we have it. That's my historical moment. My first time doing a review. If you're in the market for a pencil sharpener, check out classroomfriendlysupplies.com. All right guys, so I went against my better judgment and I allowed an older student to use my pencil sharpener. He ended up not going on a field trip. He was just sitting in my room. I was like, hey, sharpen some pencils for me. And I've been using it for four days now and lead got stuck in the sharpener. So what I did was I just went on the website, watched a video, pulled this um, handle out and it literally like just pulls out. I don't, I thought I was gonna need a screwdriver to get the screws right here, but I didn't. You can see the lead, the little orange piece of lead is in there. I'm gonna take that out and just put the handle back on. Very simple fix. So there you have it, just like new. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. What kind of pencil sharpener do you use? Do you have the pencil problems <laughs> like I do with my old electric sh electronic sharpener that sounds like a dying cow? And that's it guys, I'll see you in the next one.